15 Best Things to Do in Israel Israel is a unique country. Yes, every country is unique in some way, but Israel is exclusive. Its history, its geography, its culture, all of this is so special, that it is no wonder why this tiny piece of land draws attention from the whole world, more than any other country on the planet. This makes Israel a place where you can do many things not less unique and special than the country itself. Number 1, Head to the Tel Aviv Beach. Tel Aviv is one of the most popular locations in Israel, and is loved by locals and tourists alike. One of the best things to do in Tel Aviv Israel is to head to the enormous beach equipped with showering, and changing room facilities. You can also hire a lounge chair or a sunbed to enjoy the enigmatic views of the sunset. Local cafes and restaurants line up the beach providing meal and refreshing cocktails at dirt cheap rates. Number 2, Float in the Dead Sea. The Dead Sea constitutes 33% salt, which is approximately 8 over 9 times the salinity of water found in other water bodies. You can easily float in the Dead Sea, and read a novel while you are at it. The sea constitutes of healing mud, which is known to have many therapeutic values. This is definitely one of the most unique Israel things to do. Number 3, Go Hiking in Avdat National Park. This park contains the remains of the ancient city, Nabataean of Advart. It is a World Heritage Site, that functioned as a caravan station on the famous Spice Trail from Petra to Gaza. You can spend your time exploring the ruins of the majestic villas here with their bathhouses and churches. This is a great option if you are thinking of things to do in Israel in January, because of the pleasant weather conditions. Number 4, Explore the Old City of Jerusalem. The Old City of Jerusalem is home to different religious sites. Divided into four quarters, namely the Armenian Quarter, the Jewish Quarter, the Muslim Quarter, and the Christian Quarter, this is a place where diversity exists in peace. Although situated at a walking distance from each other, every quarter exudes a distinct personality. The Wailing Wall, Dome of the Rock, and Church of the Sepulchre are prime attractions in the old city of Jerusalem. You may opt for a half-day, or a full-day city tour to take in all that this magnificent place has to offer. Number 5, Ascend to Masada for some of the most breathtaking views in the Middle East. The mountains west of the Dead Sea are not high in altitude above the sea level, but rise magnificently comparing to the level of the lowest place on Earth. And on one of the mountain plateau-shaped peaks is Masada, an ancient fortress with breathtaking views to the Dead Sea, and the whole landscape around it, definitely one of the best things to do in Israel. Number 6, Explore Haifa and Mount Carmel. Haifa is the third largest city in Israel, beautifully situated at the Mediterranean coast. And straight from its southern suburbs, there is a low, but steep mountain, this is Mount Carmel, again related to ancient history, at the same time offering breathtaking views to the surrounding plains and the sea. One of the most gorgeous views that you can see in Haifa is the Baha'i Gardens, an iconic landmark, established on the slopes of Carmel. It is beautiful and really worth to visit place. But the mountain hides more secrets, from many ancient times. Number 7, Nimrod Fortress National Park. The Nimrod Fortress National Park has the ruins of a medieval Muslim fortress that tells a history of the Muslim rulers, and their clash with Christian crusaders. It is the biggest castle in Israel, and has been a stronghold since the 13th century. Walk through the fortress and discover dilapidated staircases once leading to a high tower, the outline of a labyrinth of hallways, watchtowers, and prepare to be met with incredible views. Number 8, Garden of Gethsemane. At the foot of Mount of Olives near Jerusalem is the Garden of Gethsemane, known for being the site where Jesus prayed with his disciples and ascended into heaven. 
Whether you're on a pilgrimage of sorts or simply a visitor interested in seeing a beautiful sight of olive trees with an undeniable significance, this is a must-see stop while in Israel. If you go, arrive early to beat the crowds and to see the olive trees in soft lighting. Number 9, Explore the Secrets of the Western Wailing Wall. Everybody knows the famous Western Wall of Jerusalem. It is one of the most popular landmarks of Israel, and needless to say, you must visit it too. It is a remnant of the original wall from the Second Temple. Every day thousands of Jewish worshippers and many other visitors go to the Western Wall for prayer, or just for a visit and taking photos. But what you see from this wall is only a small part of something much bigger. Yes, the Western Wall keeps many secrets and mysteries that are waiting to be explored. Number 10, Dive into the colorful culture of the Old City in Jerusalem. The Old City of Jerusalem is a whole fairy tale word, which must be a part of every Israel itinerary. And yes, it is colorful and full of life. You can walk for hours on its narrow streets, besides its old houses, small souvenir shops, cafes, and historical spots. A large part of it is covered by joined roofs, so the narrow streets are hidden under the roofs. Number 11, Make a Circle Around the Sea of Galilee. The Sea of Galilee is the lowest freshwater lake on the earth, with an altitude of about 210 to 215 meters below the sea level. There are beautiful views, everywhere around the lake. But it is most famous for its history, especially the events around the ministry of Jesus in 27 to 30 AD. Number 12, Shop in the Old Souks in Israel. Exploring the local markets in Israel is a standalone experience. Selling a variety of products, ranging from spices to clothes, these souks teleport you into an entirely different world. Just show off your negotiation skills and you will land up with the best deals. If you are interested in buying textiles, accessories, paintings, or glass while listening to live music, then head towards the Betzillel Arts Fair in Jerusalem on a Friday. And then there is the Carmel Market in Tel Aviv, which is nothing less than a gala fair. Starting from handmade cheese to traditional clothes, this everyday market sells everything. Number 13, grab the opportunity of snorkeling in the Red Sea. Eilat is a huge resort city in Israel, located by the shores of the Red Sea. It offers snorkeling opportunities to the tourists throughout the year. As a result, it has become a favorite destination amongst the European tourists during winters. The Coral Beach Nature Reserve is considered to be the best spot in Eilat to go snorkeling. Here, you will be able to spot more than 650 species of fish and 100 types of coral. Parrotfish, butterfly fish, marine turtles, rays, and lionfish are the common sightings at this spot. Dolphin Reef, which is one of the loveliest beach in Eilat is another best option for you. Number 14, Enjoy the buzzing nightlife of Israel. If you wish to experience the nightlife of Israel, there is no better place than Tel Aviv. Step into a club after 10 p.m. in Tel Aviv and you won't step out until the wee of hours. End your day of wandering in Israel on a high note by visiting a nightclub. Popular amongst hipsters as one of the best party cities, Tel Aviv is gradually gaining popularity as the city that never sleeps. You will find the best of bars and clubs in the Allenby, Levantin, and Lillianblum areas. The Jaffa city in Israel also attracts the party goers with it many lines of bars and clubs. Number 15, Attend the Joyous Festivals of Israel. The best way to know the culture of Israel is by attending its festivals. Sukkot, which is quite similar to the Western Harvest Festival, is an ideal Jewish traditional festival. The Summer Cultural Festival in Jerusalem, conducted during July and August showcases dance, music, and theater performances. 
Kamiel Dance Festival is one grand affair where more than 5,000 international and Israeli dancers come to give their best performance. Be it the fascinating Dead Sea or the historically bound several ruins, Israel has the perfect amalgamation to attract every kind of traveler. It wouldn't be a surprise if this holy land of Bible ranks high on a wanderer's bucket list. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to this channel.